Hello and welcome to the fourth video of the series in which we will be creating our own 2D platformer game with Unity. In the previous parts of the series, we created our player and gave him the ability to move around, whether going right, left, or jumping, or so on. But today we want to create uh, coins or items that the player can collect while playing the game and going through the level. So let's just dive into it. Okay, first of all, we want to drag our coin sprite to the scene and then we will resize it by pressing shift and dragging from one of the corners after that we will be adding a circle collider be setting this as is trigger then we want to be adding a coin script press new script and then create an add after that double click on the script when it opens we will be deleting all of this because we won't use any then we type on trigger enter 2d and this will create a new function for us in which we'll be typing player control dot kind plus equal one after that we'll type destroy and between two brackets will be our game object. Then we head to our player control script and then add a public float and we'll call this kinds. But be sure that the spelling is the same as you did in the coin script. Okay, but also, I forgot to do this. We need to set this as a public static float. Then now by saving the two scripts and playing our game, you'll see that our player can now collect the coin, but nothing really happens. There's no coin counter yet. So we want to create one. To do so, we will be creating a new UI element and selecting text then by going to our game view and selecting our text then changing this to overflow in both the horizontal and vertical directions then we'll be setting the position of our text to be in the top left corner of the screen Then we'll be setting the size of our text to, for example, 30. Just adjust the position. Now we want to add a UI element, but this time we'll choose image and drag our coin sprite again to the image source in the inspector. Then we can set the size to, for example, 0.5 in the x-axis and 0.5 in the y-axis. No, that's a little bit large. Okay, let it be 0.3 in the x-axis and 0.3 in the y. Now reposition this to be next to our coin counter. Then we'll be adding a new script. We'll be calling this coin text script. After that, open this with our Visual Studio. First of all, we'll type using Unity Engine dot UI. So that we can edit our text and the script can detect the text in the bubble class text. And we'll call this also text. Then as a start function, we want our text to be equal to get component and we write text after that we open and close a bracket then we head to our update function and we set our text dot text to be equal to player control dot coins dot to string and then we open and close a bracket now by saving this and then in our scene we can just 
create a few number of duplicates from the coin, reposition them all around the level. Now, by going in planar game, whenever he goes straight to a coin. Now, this is the end of our tutorial today. If you learned something new, don't forget to like, comment, and share the video between your friends. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel to not miss any upcoming uploads. And see you in the next one.